There are new residents scurrying around El Dorado Park. It's gross, yeah, really gross. No, I don't want to see any rats around here, no. Rats were sighted roaming about the Scottsdale Park this week, but Marlena Bonfield feels these aren't wild rats, but rather abandoned pets. They left some food, which was a whole head of cabbage. Bonfield is a volunteer with the nonprofit Any Rat Rescue, which helps rehome domesticated rats. She spent the past couple days rounding up the rodents at the park. We got two the first night, five the next. By Friday, she and other volunteers collected a total of 15. Somebody's got to do it. You know, we can't just leave them here. They're domestic animals. They rely on people. If we leave them out here, they're not going to last very long. When pet rats are released into the wild or parks like this one, any rat rescue says their survival instincts begin to kick in and they can start to form the tunnel systems like you see right below me. And they then could be more difficult to get out of here, which means there could be rats right underneath me as I speak. You got to keep in mind, we've got day jobs. Rats don't. The digging is their day job. Any rat rescue says it can be common for owners to abandon pet rats at parks, but they can cause big problems. They can infest the area as rats reproduce quickly and predators like coyotes might not trail far behind. It's not really fair to take a domesticated animal and just dump it in a park like this. Nobody benefits from that. The nonprofit is hoping their efforts will not only save the rats at the park, but help clear up any stigma these rodents may carry. Any Rat Rescue feels that there's only about five left at El Dorado Park, which they hope to get by this weekend. Otherwise, that five that might turn into 25 pretty quickly. Oh. Your face was very close to that rat hole. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah I, was, I was getting in. I was, trying to, I was trying to find them. I did learn that yeah. uh, they don't really go for cheese. Oh. It's all about the peanut butter. Peanut butter. Well, I get that. I like <laughs> peanut butter, too. I mixed on the rats because remember Mrs. Frisbee and the rats of Nim? Remember that old story <laughs> when we were kids? They were so yes. smart and brilliant yes. and helpful. I was so. told they are very smart mm. as pets and whatnot. So. I just right. think of ratatouille. <laughs> See? Rats. Story for Steven, every rat. Thank you. Thanks, Stephen.